So now what we want to do, we want to click on Visual Basic, and we've got uh, we've got our PowerPoint here. We then want to go to Insert Module. Now before we go any further, we're going to go to File, Save As, and then we're going to save it as a PowerPoint Macro Enabled Template, not Template, sorry, Presentation, and that will mean we can uh, we can put this Java so that this Visual Basic code in. So now what we want to do, we first of all want to make three sections where it'll save all the data. So we're going to go to dim username as string, then hit enter. Bits of it will change colour, don't worry about that. Dim number correct as integer oh integer and dim number wrong as integer then I'm gonna make sure there's a gap make sure there's a one line gap then sub your name capital Y capital N just make sure you've got all the capitals in the right place otherwise this code won't work open close bracket hit enter you'll now see a line uh, underneath the well above what you're editing and an ed sub line will have turned up we now I want to go username equals input box open bracket prompt uh, colon equals type your name. What this does is when the when the pop up box comes up asking you to type your name, it'll say type your name to basically next to it. So message box uh, speech open quotations. Welcome to the France Trivia Quiz Close Speech Marks Plus Username This basically tells it to put the username next to Welcome to the France Trivia Quiz Pl uh, Comma VB Application Modal Bracket uh, Comma then open speech marks space France trivia quiz no space close speech marks we now want to do the sub correct so once again sub correct open close brackets message box Well done. That's the correct answer. Close speech marks plus username, comma, VB application modal, comma, France. Trivia quiz. Okay, so then we then need to go to number correct equals number correct plus one and active presentation dot slide show window dot view dot next what this tells it to do is once it's told you that you got that right it will go to the next question for you without you having to go to it yourself we're now going to do the uh, what it should do if you get it wrong so once we've done that just hit enter message box 
basically just put what you, uh, what you want in to uh, want it, you want it to say basically. I've just put sorry, that's the wrong answer. Plus username. VB application modal again and fans basically what this VB application modal is doing is telling it what to put on the top bar here when the little pop up window comes up so then of course we're going to go to number wrong equals number wrong plus one and then just tell it to go to the next slide again so active presentation presentation this helps if I spell it right really dot view dot next okay now what we're going to do we're going to set the start sub so sub start open close brackets enter so number correct basically to tell it that when somebody starts the quiz it resets the scores and then number wrong equals a zero and then your name to tell it to go to the your name sub so it asks for so it asks for your name and then active presentation dot slide show window dot view dot next this basically tells it to go to question one and then we're done oh we've got one more the results the most important bit well one of the most important bits so sub results open close brackets message box you got and number correct and out open speech marks out of close speech marks and and then number correct plus number wrong so this basically tells it to add up the amount they got right and the amount they got wrong and basically that gives them the total score basically uh, then click and open speech marks comma close speech marks and user name close brackets comma vb application modal france trivia quiz okay so now we have our coding all in visual basic you've now just learnt some basic visual basic uh, that sounds pretty stupid just control and s to save it now what we're going to do we're going to apply this coding to uh, to our to our questions so first of all we need to go to the start button just click there format then we want oh no so we want to go to insert action run macro start okay then we want to go to uh, question one And basically, the centre corner on the French flag is white. So, oh, so if we run macro on blue, that's wrong. Okay, click the wrong macro action. Uh, wrong. Okay. White. Correct. Okay. And then I'll come back to you as soon as I've finished high plinking all of these. Pull up your lighters, I clash the titans Fight the fighters, might fight the biters Spit to my throat, got tons of lighters That's on a Monday morning <laughs> Taking over, run straight past you No warning, not a real disaster Harder, faster, stronger, longer This one here was top of the classroom 
All right, so what we've got, we've got all 10 questions either linked to the correct uh, Visual Basic code or the wrong Visual Basic code. Now we're going to set it to show the results. So we want to click the results button, go to action, run macro, results, and hit OK. So now what we're going to do, we're going to test this. But first, we need to get we need to be able to get onto this page of the quiz. So we're going to go to France, and we're just going to go uh, um, click here to go to quiz. Let's just format that so we have no bullet point. Insert hyperlink to place in this document and then slide two okay so now if we hit f5 then we click on france i'm gonna do it uh, don't worry i'm gonna do a i'm gonna do a video on how to do this advanced powerpoint skill so go to france about france click it go to quiz okay so now we want to click it to start the quiz and first of all here we go you've got to type your name so i'm just going to put dan Okay, welcome to the French trivia quiz, Dan. Thank you. What is the centre colour on the French flag? Why? Oh, well done, that's the correct answer, Dan. What is the capital of France? I'm going to get this wrong simply so you can see the code. Berlin. Well done, that's the correct answer, Dan. I put the wrong visual basic code on that one. What is the president of France? Arnold Schwarzenegger, let's say. Sorry, that's the wrong answer, Dan. There we go, that's the code we want. What is the currency? It's the euro. What channel connects England and France? The English. For you, those of you who don't know, ITV1 and BBC1 are English TV channels. What year did the French Revolution begin? 1789. Approximately how long is the Tour de France? 2,000 miles. What famous tower stands in Paris? Eiffel Tower. In what museum is the Mona Lisa kept? The Louvre. And what French delicacy is related to the slug? The snail. Okay, so now we come to the results page. Let's see if it's all paid off. You got 9 out of 10, Dan. Well, including that uh, code that I put wrong. Yeah, I did get 9 out of 10. So it's added it all up right. It's done it correctly. So our uh, quiz works, basically. I will put a... On my website, I'll put a download where you can download the questions that I used and the... Uh, visual basic code that I used as well so you can sort of do this yourself so that was Dan from PC Simple hope you like this video look uh, look out for the video how I show you how to originally make this menu bar on PowerPoint and yeah see you in the next video bye